Well, as the lights went out, it was another Slater versus Palmovsky battle into the first corner. And as we saw yesterday, Alicia Palmovsky got the advantage through Cop's corner. Sadly, though, her lead would be even more short-lived than it was in the opening race on Saturday afternoon. All of them got cleanly through Cop's corner, but when they descended upon Maggots and Beckett, it all kicked off. Palmovsky had a wobble on a damp patch of track, slid across the grass from the race lead and spun in front of the pack, miraculously avoided by everybody else. But further back, there was Carnage, Tom Sprague, uh, sideways through Beckett's got a big whack as he turned through the next left-hander and his car was uh, wounded to the point that he couldn't make it to the flag and we had to have one lap behind the safety car to recover the damaged cars. On the restart, Freddie Slater immediately started to build up his lead, but as he did so, he was exceeding track limits. He was given a final warning and was then given a five-second penalty from which he would have to try uh, and build a lead in order to retain the victory. Palmovsky was charging through uh, the order, though. That safety car really benefiting her she was moving well inside the top 10 pretty much as soon as the green flags were back out. Mikey Porter then involved in some contact with Hugo Schwarzer and very slight contact with his teammate uh, Reza Sawurathan as he tried to take avoiding action. And uh, Reza and Hugo would be really the centre of the entertainment in the closing stages as they battled for second whilst also trying to chase down the race leader. Charlie Hart uh, fell down the order slightly through the mid part of the race, would lose another spot before the flag uh, to Alicia Palmovsky. But Freddie Slater, by half a second only, once that five second penalty was applied, claimed his fifth race victory of the season from five races. A dominant start to the season for Freddie Slater. So drivers make their way down into pit lane. Then they will shortly be up onto the podium to celebrate another race win for Freddie Slater. A cracking race here around the Silverstone Grand Prix circuit in the Michelin Ginetta Junior Championship.